today on Wicked Good Eats we're going to make a uh, Christmas Eve specialty uh, part of the Feast of the Seven Fishes. Uh, we're going to make a nice white clam chowder. Uh, we'll start off uh, with our ingredients and with any good clam chowder you're going to need some nice chopped clams. I use the nice um, ocean clams that comes with the juice so two cans of that. Those are basically three pounds so you're looking at six pounds so uh, that's the juice and the clams. You're going to need some sea salt, some garlic, basil, dill weed, white pepper, cornstarch, heavy cream, one pint, two whole sticks of salted sweet cream butter, one onion all chopped up, two celery stalks all chopped up, and you're going to want to cube up these potatoes. I use uh, red, nice red bliss potatoes, um, six of those. Okay, so first thing we're going to do, get our pot going on a medium heat. Take our olive oil, just drizzle that on the bottom of the pan. You don't need a lot. Onion, put that in. And uh, celery. And we're going to cook that, oh, for about a good uh, 10 minutes. Okay, we're about 2-3 minutes into this. Uh, onions and celery. Um, now you could do this in a separate pan, but uh, I don't like to dirty up extra pans, so I'm just going to cook this down and then I'm going to put it in this bowl once it's ready. So it's probably got another uh, two or three more minutes to go. Once you start seeing the um, onions become clear instead of white, uh, then you know they're ready. Okay, so we've taken out the um, celery and the onion. I'm just put in this bowl for now and got my parsley all cut up. Now we're going to add in our uh, two sticks of um, butter. Okay, and we got the flame on a very low heat. Okay, so we don't want to burn that butter. Okay, so you can see our butter is all melted now. And we got a uh, half a cup of cornstarch and we're just going to drizzle that in. Okay, like that. Keep a whisk and just slowly work it into the butter and that'll thicken. I want to slow cook this. Okay, so now you can see it's starting to bubble, it's starting to cook, so that's good. And at this point, we're going to take our third of a cup of cream sherry and slowly add that in. Now you'll notice when you add liquid to this it's really going to thicken up. Okay. Mm. Oh, the cream sherry smells so good. And you can see that's cooking almost getting like a cake. We've got some of our clam juice out of the clams. And we're slowly going to pour that in. About half that, half the amount. And slowly work that in. Okay. And again, do about half the amount. Work it in some more. Yeah, nice and that makes the, the chowder very smooth. Very smooth and silky. Okay. okay. <clears throat> We've gone in and incorporated all the clam juice. We haven't put the clams in yet. Um, and you can see what that looks like and it's very loose but it's going to thicken as it cooks and again it's on low okay so what we're going to do is we're going to add our potatoes okay to that and we'll mix that in and that's going to help it thicken also as the potato cooks and kind of breaks down the starches get in there okay and we're going to let that uh, cook on low for a half an hour. I'm going to cover it and we'll come back. We're going to get our seasonings ready to go. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add some fresh parsley. And that's about a tablespoon's worth of parsley. Parsley's, fresh parsley is really nice. Uh, we're going to add some dill weed. But dill is very strong so only one teaspoon of dill weed. Okay. That gives it a nice flavor, very nice flavor. This is so 
thousands and thousands of bowls of this at the restaurant. And uh, white pepper, okay, again, just a teaspoon, okay. Sea salt, we're going to want one tablespoon of sea salt, okay, because there's salt in the butter, salted butter, okay. And you can always add more uh, to taste later, okay. And uh, basil. Um, you're going to want one tablespoon of basil. Okay, put that in the bowl. Spice is ready. Okay, see what that looks like. She's been cooking for about 20 minutes. And you can see what that, start getting this froth up at the top. Get a nice stir. You can see that's thickening up real nice. So we're going to go ahead and add back in our onions and celery. Okay, and give that a nice turn. And at this point we're going to put in our clams. Go ahead and add those. Got to have the clams. Okay, I'm going to incorporate that in. You can see that pot starting to really fill up. A lot of clams in this chowder. No skimping on the clams. Okay. And now we're going to go in and add the last of our ingredients. Alright, so now we have our garlic. And we're going to add in one two good tablespoons of garlic. Okay. I'll take our pint of heavy cream and just pour that right in. This is going to whiten it right up. This is where the white comes in, white clam chowder. Okay, good to the last drop. Show you what that looks like. All right. And give it a good stir. And you can see that's just about filled up close to the top. Then we got our seasonings. We pre poured out. Put those right in. Okay. Slowly work that in. Give it a good stir. And again, this is on low, low heat. Okay. And for the first half hour, we're going to keep it covered. And then after that, the second half hour, we're going to uncover it. So we'll get some of that moisture out and thicken up even more. But right now, we want it covered so it'll get up to temperature. So we'll come back in a half an hour. Okay, so when you see that steam starting to come off, like that, that's when you want to take the cover off and let it reduce. So give it a good stir. See that steam starting to come up. Again, this is on low. Okay, so we're about uh, half an hour into it and you can see that starting to thicken up nice. All right, so the chowder, she's already. And you can see it thickened up quite a bit. And, um, taking some out cool off for the Wolfmeister right here so that's nice and cool so he doesn't burn his tongue let's see how he likes it there you go Wolfie Merry Christmas oh he likes it oh he's eating it is that good Wolfie <laughs> oh yeah Oh, you like clam chowder, huh? Hey, you like that? You ate all that chowder? That's gonna put you right out. You'll be, in, you'll be sleeping early. There's the tail. It's a winner. <laughs>